Okay, so today we are going, we are at Mr. Newman's property here at the base of Stone Mountain. We put this swarm trap up here a few weeks ago and we were fortunate enough to catch a swarm. So today we're gonna to be taking the swarm hive down and we're gonna be implanting it into that big hive that we have stationed over there. So it's gonna be a good time. There's gonna be lots of bees. Alan's working the tractor. Really appreciate him for it. Mom did the great painting on the hive. Looks good. So we're really excited and uh, hope you'll watch it with us. So here we go. Okay, so it was a little tricky, but we got the swarm hive out of the tree. And now we're gonna place it in the uh, frames into the new hive. And we should see a good amount of bees. Oh, I need some, I need another pair of gloves. Do you have their honey feeder in already, son? Huh? Do you have their honey feeder in? Uh, yeah, I do. Oh, good. That's beautiful. Look at that. They're doing good, aren't they? Yeah, that's really good. They're doing fine. Very nice. It's a healthy colony, that's for sure. I need that little chunk of honeycomb for that guy at the farmer's market. <laughs> you want to grab up?
You can shake them off in the hive. Perfect. There's no brood in there. I think there was brood. In this little piece? Oh, not in the little piece, no. Ooh. Is it heavy? This queen is an egg laying machine. Cool. That's beautiful. Yeah, I see some brood in there, son. Now, normally what we like to do is we, we like to be able to spot the queen. Are you filming? Yes, I am. Okay, sorry. Uh, we like to be able to spot the queen whenever we're going into the hive. However, come on, get out of the way. However, if we can see really good brood, like we're seeing with this swarm hive, then we don't need to spot the queen. And we know she's in there somewhere doing her job. Got drones. This looks like nectar. Okay, so um, we've sat out here about 10 minutes and um, everybody's checking everything out. We'll leave the swarm hive here about 24 hours so that they can acclimate to their new home on the hill. <laughs> Have still a few coming back to the tree. That's just what they do. They'll be able to hear the colony and the new hive and they'll be um, attracted to going down to it. Another fun afternoon keeping bees.